Exploring the phrase, from the shadows, unveiling its meaning. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning channel. Today, we're going to explore an interesting English phrase, from the shadows. This phrase is not only picturesque but also rich in meaning and usage. So, let's dive in and uncover the various aspects of this intriguing expression. From the shadows, literally refers to something emerging from a dark or hidden place. Shadows are areas where light is blocked, creating darkness or partial darkness. In this context, the phrase often implies something or someone becoming visible or known after being hidden or unnoticed. It's like discovering something that was always there but not seen. In a figurative sense, from the shadows, can have various implications. Often, it suggests something operating in secret or without being noticed, coming into the open. For instance, in a story, a character might work from the shadows to achieve their goals without revealing their identity. It can also imply emerging from obscurity or insignificance into a more prominent or visible role. Let's look at some examples to see how this phrase is used in different contexts. 1. In literature and movies, the hero emerged from the shadows to save the day. Here, it implies the hero was hidden or unknown before this heroic act. 2. In everyday conversation, after years of working from the shadows, she finally got the recognition she deserved. This suggests the person was working hard but unnoticed until now. 3. In news and journalism, the issue has come out from the shadows, sparking a national debate. This indicates that the issue was previously ignored or unknown to the public. This phrase also holds cultural and idiomatic value in English. It is often used in mystery, suspense, and drama genres to create a sense of intrigue or surprise. It's a popular phrase in storytelling, indicating a transition from hidden to revealed, unknown to known. I hope this exploration of the phrase, from the shadows, has been enlightening. It's a fantastic example of how English language can paint vivid pictures and convey deep meanings with just a few words. Remember, language learning is not just about grammar and vocabulary, but also about understanding the beauty and depth of expressions. Until our next video, keep exploring and enjoying the richness of the English language.